Oh my gosh, I am so sorry. I, I just, I didn't see you there. I'm sorry? I said, are you from Dallas? Oh, no, no, I'm from San Diego. I was only in LA for a few days and now I'm heading home. Ah, well that's nice. So are you going home or? Well, I'm hoping to spend a few days in Dallas. That's why I was wondering if that's where you came from. Oh, uh, what's in Dallas? Ma'am? <laughs> I don't want to bore you with the ramblings of an old lady about an old story. No, really, it's fine. Well, if my memory serves me right, we met in the summer of 1958 at a school bus stop. <laughs> I'm so sorry, I just didn't see you there. Um, don't you have anything to put those in? Yeah, but I left it back in my... Are you sure? Okay, thanks. <laughs> what are you reading? William Shakespeare. I trust you've heard of him. Well, you read that kind of stuff for fun? Yes, I do, actually. Why? It's just very beautiful. Love looks not with the eyes, but with the mind, and therefore is winged Cupid painted blind. No, no, just... Kinda all sounds like nonsense to me. It's not nonsense, it's... I'll show you. He never did end up understanding Shakespeare. So you guys were neighbors and you didn't really like each other? Oh, no. At first he was a bit of an ass, but we did become quite good friends. After that day, we spent a lot of time together. You were trying to look at my cards. No, no, no I wasn't looking at your cards. I wasn't. I saw you peeking. Well, I have such a good hand that I don't need to peek. Okay, then prove it. What? If I win, you have to kiss me right on the lips. What? No, I mean... Well, I'm... if it makes you uncomfortable, you don't have to worry, because apparently, you've got a great hand. Well? Well, okay. Yeah. On the count of three. One. Two. Three. <laughs> oh, come on! That's not fair. Okay, fine. See, that wasn't so... Yes, we spent a lot of time together that summer. I tried to teach him to love Shakespeare, and he taught me to enjoy life without having my head buried in a book. <laughs> if you don't mind me asking, why didn't you end up with him? Like, why is he in Dallas? Hold on, hold on. What are you doing? <laughs> oh, no. Oh, yes. This is so stupid. No, dancing is easy. All right, just 
Just follow my lead. All right? How do you know this anyway? My mother taught me. Look, just just follow my lead. I can't what? dance. Do you trust me? No. <laughs> All right. I'll walk you through it, okay? All right. You put your hands here. And I put my hands here. And then we just sway. And look. We're dancing. We're swaying. No, we're not just swaying. We're dancing. Because I'm going to spin you like this. Oh, very <laughs> smooth. Did you learn that from your mother too? Yes, actually. <laughs> I'm moving to Dallas. I know. Your mother told my mother a week ago. Do you want to say anything? Or no. Why not? It's not fair. I don't want everything to change. I don't want you to leave. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. That was the last time I saw him. He packed his bags and left with his family the next week. Ma'am? Yes? When you get to Dallas, how will you know he's not... Dead? Or married? How do you know he's still there? I don't. through 